Hi and welcome to this video. Today we're going to present multiple CD stations for JVC tools. Going left to right, we have the CDS, that's the precision station that will work with the T210 handle, okay, and the C210 tips. That's a 40 watt station, by the way. Then we have the CDP. The CDP works with the AM120 tweezer and the C120 tips. That's an 80 watt station. That works for really good for 042s or 201s when you're working with Leo caps. Then we have the CDP. The CDP is a 130 watt station. You can work with over 500 tips with this station, by the way. Okay, then we have the CDA. CDA works with the AP250 and the C250 tips. That's more for a semi-automatic sewing for cables, for example. And then we have the CDD. That's for really precision, uh, these soldering tips. If no one knows about the tip technology for JVC, it's the most important thing. Uh, the, any tip for JVC, doesn't matter if you're working with a really like big fat chisel for a heavy duty station, or a really like fine tip for a conical for a nano station, has the same technology, okay? At the end of each tip, there's a thermal couple on the heating element. So that means that for example, that thermal couple will have to communicate with the microprocessor. So imagine that you're working with a SAC 305 flat rate or a heavy ground plane. The moment that the tip touches something that's demanding out of heat, that sensor will have to communicate and deliver more power by itself, avoiding cold solar joints. As well, you can see it, it's called CD because it's, the, it's a compact station. It has the smallest footprint in the market. The stations heat up in only two to three seconds. So at the moment that I pick it up, it goes from room temperature all the way to 350 in a matter of three seconds, okay? Our tips, another benefit, it lasts longer than the competition. Normally, three to five months longer for multiple reasons. First of all, because as I mentioned before, you are able to work with lower temperatures that, thanks to the tip technology. And as well, the other benefit is hibernation mode. As JVC has the sleep mode, as other companies, it, and what it means is that you put it um, back on the cradle of the tip, and the moment that you put it back, it goes to a certain temperature. Hibernation mode means that the moment you put back the handle in the cradle, it goes to room temperature. What you're doing here, you're avoiding oxidation. Here, the moment that you pick it up again, as a, thanks to the tip technology, as it heats up in only two seconds, you will not notice any type of lack of temperature between going from the station to start solar. Maybe you're thinking, where's the cleaner? The cleaner is hidden here, that's, that's pretty nice. Uh, there's a splash card here, and the Brillo pad, it's easy to take out, it's here, okay? Also, if you're used to working with the sponge, you can put it, the sponge inside. There's other like little openings here where you can swap the tip, and that will extend even more the tip light. Another benefit is that if you're left-handed, this is to maintain the cord out of the operation, you can move the holder to the other side. Also, the cord is high temp, it will not run, okay? Another thing JVC takes in consideration a lot is the safety of a technician. Okay, I, probably you've seen in other uh, brands how they take out the tips with the bare hand, you can get burned. JVC, the way they do does it is with this little extractor, you pull and that's it. It's completely safe and faster to exchange any type of tip. The moment you want to put it back, you put it next to each other, and then in these little holes, you can use this uh, to 10 or 45, you press and it hits up in a matter of two seconds. Uh, this station in particular is the CDS, so this one here this is a 40 watt station. When you pick it up, you can see how fast it goes. Um, a lot of people ask me, how do I protect my, my, my temperature, for example? Any station in JVC has a four digit password protector. What that means is the following. Imagine that one of your technicians is cranking up the temperature and you don't want them to be oxidizing the tip that fast. You can set up a four digit password that they will not be able to change the temperature. Either you can work with one temperature, two temperatures, three temperatures, or leave it open and you can work with a different range of temperatures. That's it. Thank you so much for joining. Appreciate it.